Hi everyone, my name is Jason and today I'm going to go over how to search um, unexpected shutdown events in the event of using PowerShell. Um, unexpected shutdowns get recorded as event ID 6008 in the system log. And um, so what we want to do, which I've already done, is I've powered off this VM and I brought it back up. So what we'll do is go ahead and log in. And usually you would see a box come up, a dialog box that says shut down event tracker. It would be it would say please provide the reason this server unexpectedly shut down. I would put unknown investigating. So when the server came back up it went ahead and recorded the 6000 event, event in the event log. So we'll go ahead and open up uh, PowerShell ISE. Go ahead and close this window out so we have a uh, full window. So the first command to run to check for that event is get dash event log. So get dash event log, log name system. So we are looking in a system event log, and then we would put where dash object, where the object, open curly brace. Polish sign underscore dot event ID, and the comparable operator is equals, where the event ID equals, and then we want to type uh, open curly brace, or open tick, 6008 close tick close brace so we see our entry here and if we want to expand on that we want to see more information that's provided we'll go ahead and hit the up arrow here hit pipe select dash object properties I want to select all the properties asterisk and we want to select this first entry up here. So we'll go ahead and type select that's object dash first one. And as you see, it shows that it was an unexpected shutdown. Um, the server name, the event ID. It's the entry type is the s error. And time generated, time written. So let's say, um, and I've already simulated this, is what I've done is I've went up here, restart guest, and that'll record that VMware tools restarted the computer. So if you're not sure if a user restarted it, but you, you think it might be a user that restarted the computer server. Um, you can check for event ID uh, 1074 in event, system event log and to use PowerShell to search for that go ahead and hit the upper arrow a couple of times 1074 and to explain this command again um, get dash event log searches events in this system in the event log and we're pointing it to the system event log and where dash object it's like where this event and we're searching for the property event ID is equal to the 1074 number so we'll go ahead and enter on that And something has happened to this VM. No worries, because we can go to the other one. Okay, I fixed the technical difficulty, so we'll go ahead and continue. We'll hit enter. And as 
you can see the process C program files, VMware, VMware tools has initiated a restart on behalf of user, but we'll go ahead and dive in that one a little bit deeper. So we'll go ahead and hit up arrow a couple times and we'll go ahead and change this 6008 event to 1074. So you get all the information, the event ID, server name, um, entry type, this is the informational entry type and event log. Source, user 32, this means a user restarted it, which was the NT authority system user. And time written. And for one more command, which is handy if a server blue screens, we could search for um, the 1001 event ID, which will actually show you um, if their server created a, um, a dump file or a mini dump file in um, the system uh, C Windows System 32 directory. Um, I don't have that particular event in the event log at this time, but I could show you the command. So we'll go ahead and type get event log. Log name system where event ID per operator is equals one thousand one and the source. like bug check now it's searching event log and nothing since it's not there it's not going to show anything but if it, the server did blue screen it would show you some information and to expand on that you would add select dash object property list all the properties asterisk and select object first one now again it's searching again so in conclusion I have showed you how to search for the unexpected shutdown event log which is this command here and if you want to expand this entry, you run this command here. Search for um, if a user restarted the computer, which is this command here. And to expand on that, just run this command. And if you want to search for uh, blue screen, which would be recorded under event 1001 source bug check run this command and as I said before it would record um, where the mini dump file is located and you could run this command to expand on that and any questions let me know thank you